not a bad day to spend outside on this Memorial Day. Temperatures will be in the 70s, falling into the 60s as we start to see the sun begin to set. So just before 9 o'clock, it'll be 67 degrees. Then mild temperatures overnight. We're also dealing with rather calm winds. Look at this. So right now, our winds are calm across the region. We do have a 9 mile per hour wind speed out of the east through Springboro. But overall, great conditions. If you're spending some time outdoors, eating outside, grilling, those napkins shouldn't fly away too easily. Here's a look at our temperatures right now. It is 71 in Dayton. We're at 70 in Troy, 70 in Greenville, 70 in Springboro, Xenia, Springfield is down to 69. A look at our Goodwill Auto Auction camera time lapse. Notice we're losing some sunlight. Cloud coverage is increasing here in the Miami Valley. Mostly just some serious clouds, those thin clouds that are high above uh, are the ground. However, we are seeing a few uh, thickening clouds, maybe a few cumulus clouds trying to develop. Here are our lows tonight. As the cloud coverage increases, it is going to keep our temperatures on the mild side. Not quite as chilly. We're going to stay out of the 40s tonight. 56 in Dayton, 53 in Xenia, 54 in Wilmington, 55 in Springboro, 55 in Troy, 54 in Greenville, and 54 into Salina highs tomorrow in the 70s and not just the 70s the upper 70s so we'll be in the mid 70s for Springfield 77 for Troy we'll make it to 78 degrees through Dayton so it is going to be a little bit warmer tomorrow here's the breakdown in your hour by hour forecast 6 a.m. 57 degrees we are going to see more cloud coverage tomorrow so don't expect a whole lot of sunlight 71 there by noon 75 there at 3 p.m. here's the cloud coverage increasing now this is our band of thickening clouds going right through portions of uh, Wayne County, Indiana, Gr uh, Dark County, and into my Ami County. There is a chance for a shower, a spotty light shower, but overall any rain is evaporating before it gets to the ground. So we should stay dry the rest of the evening as high pressure continues to hold steady across Ohio, but that will change as we head into Wednesday and this low pressure system continues to track east northeast as it does so will tap into that Gulf moisture and it will send rain up into the Miami Valley. We have a 70% chance of rain on Wednesday, a 50% into Thursday. Day. Some thunderstorms possible Thursday into Friday. Notice as the rain moves in on Wednesday, our temperatures fall. We'll be 72 degrees on Wednesday, and then we'll slowly work our way back up into the 80s there by Friday. A look at future check does show the cloud coverage across the area. Uh, notice uh, not too much in the way of sunlight heading into your Tuesday. Now Tuesday night, this is when we start to see the rain increasing scattered light showers at first after midnight. Then we start to see widespread rain across the region late Wednesday morning. Here's the breakdown on our rainfall potential, mostly just some light rain on Wednesday. Then we see some heavier showers possible on Thursday, a chance of thunderstorms on Friday. Some of us could see around an inch of rain by the end of the week. Notice we do keep it unsettled into the weekend. It's going to be kind of that pop-up afternoon thunderstorm activity that we tend to see in the summertime. With these temperatures on the warm side, we are going to have a nice uh, first weekend for meteorological summer. That starts on June 1st, which is Tuesday. So it'll be 78 degrees on Tuesday, falling with the rain on Wednesday, heating back up into the weekend, 84 on Saturday, 86 on Sunday, and 85 on Monday with another chance of thunderstorms.